Heck yeah. Everyone who's ever played Bully in their life has done that at least once. How's it going guys? It's Ace here with my very first video on my gaming channel and I am very excited to finally get started. I have missed YouTube for so long and the gaming channel here is going to be a very fresh start for me and like I'm just so excited to get into this and start making content again because I've just missed it so much. So just forgive me if I'm a little unorganized here and it doesn't seem professional because I honestly don't know what I'm doing yet. But hopefully as these episodes progress, I will continuously get better at it. But anyways, enough about me. So today, we're going to be playing a game that I really love a lot and that is very special to me. And that holds a place that's near and dear to my heart. Bully Scholarship Edition. This game is so amazing. I absolutely had to make this be the first game that I play on my channel. I was debating on FNAF, but I went with Bully because I like it a little better. I have so many memories of this game playing it back in the day with my brothers and my cousin who would just stay up all hours of the night just goofing around on it and having just harmless fun. I don't know, it's just one of those games that it has so much replayability in my opinion. And overall the game just has a certain charm to it and not many games are like this anymore. So yeah, those are some of the many reasons why Bully is one of my favorite games of all time. It would probably help if I plugged in the controller. You can all tell I'm new at this, can't you? Doesn't seem to be working. Okay, well, I've had this issue before. Um, just as a little tip for you guys, if any of you play Bully on PC and you have a PlayStation 5 controller, um, Steam says you can't play it on there with it, but you actually can. But it's a little trick. Here, I'm going to show you. Um, let's go into story mode here. Um, okay, yeah, I deleted my save file from the last time. So yeah, once the game is loaded in, you just want to exit out of there and quit to the main menu. And then once it gets there, you should be able to play, as you can see. Just thought I'd give you guys that tip if you ever want to play this game for yourself. Okay, so without further ado, let's actually jump into it this time. Alright, here we are. Welcome to Bulwark. It's a tad bit laggy, but it's not like that during Jimmy, the gameplay. Jimmy, please say something. James? What? Who are you? Mom, I thought you told me never to talk to strangers. Like I said before, Jimmy, please be nice to your new stepfather. She looks like a cougar. No, it's not just because of the print on her shirt. She looks like an actual cougar. Okay, rich guy. I love it that you're twice as old as my grandfather and you're fat and bald. Uh, That's enough! Yeah. I've had it with you, you little brat. Uh, Jimmy's such an asshole, but he's a relatable asshole. That sounds weird. Don't take that out of context. You've upset your mother. I've got half a mind to beat you. Half a mind is right. Suddenly he realizes. I can't <laughs> believe you, you little monster. We'll deal with you when we get back from our honeymoon. Next year. God, like, who takes a honeymoon for a freaking year? Is, is that really a thing in real life? Like, who does that? And they're going on a cruise ship as well. If I'm not mistaken. Well, I, I know they are, but... Still, like, would they really allow you to be on it for that long? Here we are, boy. Bullworth Academy. Bullworth Academy. The worst school in the country. Have fun, Jimmy. I'll think of you from our cruise ship. <laughs> Whatever. Pretty spooky gargoyle. Welcome to Bulwark. Yeah, get out of here. We didn't need him anyway. Mom, why'd you marry that phony? What is wrong with you? Oh, I can't believe this. You must be the huh? Hopkins boy. Where'd you come from? We've been expecting you. Welcome to Bullworth Academy. Ah, I'm sure you'll be very happy here. Very happy indeed. I have never anyway, liked I can't Andrews. spend my life waiting around for naughty little boys. I've got a man to make happy. 
The headmaster is expecting you, Hopkins, in his study. Okay. His study is over there, boy, in the main building. Don't keep Dr. Crabblesnitch waiting. He's a brilliant man. Brilliant. She gives me a lot of Judge Judy vibes for some reason. And here we are. We are in Woolworth Academy. Look at him. We're here in our brown jacket. I used to have a jacket like that. Oh, don't fuck with me already. Get out of the way. Wait, you guys gonna do something? Okay, it's pretty much just a rule of thumb as a bully player to beat these guys up in the beginning, so... Let's go ahead and get into our first fight. Yeah. Fuck you and your stupid fucking face. Where'd your friend go? Yeah. That's my tactic when fighting. I beat them up a bunch whenever I jump on them the first time. And then I jump on... Yeah, I jump on them again and I knock the breath out of them. And that's usually the good tactic I do. Oh, easy dude. Alright, let's go ahead and do the missions. Um, by the way, I have a few mods installed, but it's not going to be anything that's really game changing. It's just like Jimmy's beta skateboard and a, a few different textures, I'm not sure. We'll, we'll see when we get there. Hello there, ma'am. Alright, here we go. Ah, yes. So, you must be Hopkins. Uh, uh-huh. What? Uh-huh. What? I meant yes, sir. Very good. Now, let me see. You've done a lot of naughty things, haven't you? Vandalism, graffiti, bad language, violent conduct, disrespecting staff. Oh, I'm scared of you, Hopkins. Come on, give me a break. Yes, I've never met a boy like you. Never in all my life. Hopkins, you're quite the nastiest little boy I have ever encountered. Tell me, why should I waste my time on you? I don't know. Because it's my calling. It's what I do. You excel at causing trouble, and I excel at fixing little boys like you, at making you into respectable members of our community here at the Academy. I've got a good feeling about you, boy, a feeling you and I are going to be great friends. You keep that nose clean, boy. Or I shall clean it myself. Miss Danvers, are you back yet? Yes, Headmaster. And I got your tea. That's a lot you of tea. You are good to me, Miss Danvers. No more than you deserve, Headmaster. Take our new friend Hopkins here and show him around the school and get him properly attired. Certainly, Headmaster. Come along, boy. I haven't got all day. And boy, remember, you will have a clean nose. So keep it clean. Quit talking we'll about clean our nose. You. I, I've always thought that was such a strange line. Like my God. So here I am at probably hey, the hang worst on. school in Did the country. He have brains back there. Alumni are nothing but arms dealers, oh, serial killers, and corporate lawyers. Real scum. And that old creep thinks he can tame me. We shall see, my friend. I, I only, only give, give people what they have, have coming, coming to them. them. Okay. Where's your uniform? Yeah, 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 yes, chap. Run along now, child. Okay, um, as I was saying, um, am I just crazy or did I see a brain in Mr. Crabble's, Dr. Crabble's Snitch's office? Like, I could have swore there was a brain in a jar. No, no. <laughs> I might just be crazy, though. Anyways, we're gonna pretend we- Oh, I'm so sorry. We're gonna pretend we didn't do that, or see that. Okay, let's go do our thing. Oh, what? Why is that like that? I never understood that either. I, I've got a lot of input to say on this game. Like, I, there's just so much I could talk about. And not enough time. Yeah. Time for a beat down. Get the new kid. Beat him down. All right, here we go. Back up, fuck up, back up, buddy. Yeah, catch these fists. Flying fist of fury. Yeah. Fuck on the ground. Kicking the balls. Yeah. 
I think he wants me to give him the finisher. I mean, you're saying it a billion times, dude. I mean, come on. I heard you. That is pretty gross of Jimmy to do that. New kid, dead. Oh, god damn. That's enough of that. Break it up. Why are you not in your uniform, young man? Go change immediately! Aw, oh, come on! Jimmy did deserve that punch a little bit, even though they were assholes to him at first. Hey, you're the new kid. Yeah? What's it to you? Friendly, aren't you? Give me a break, loser. Hey, relax, friend. You're all pent up. Go easy or they put you on medication. Very. They did to me. Boy, nearly sent me insane. That's fascinating. Now if you'll excuse me. I said me. relax, friend. Get off, man. Listen to me, tough guy. You just arrived at the toughest school in the country, and I'm offering to be your friend. Trust me, in a place like this, you're going to need friends. So it's up to you. You going to play nice or what? Yeah, sure. Good. So how about I show you around? <laughs> We don't have a bar in the door, just a soda machine. Beam Cola. I wonder what these taste like. I imagine they're probably not good for that. You should change into your uniform if you don't want to get in trouble. Well, no, I imagine they would be like Dr. Thunder, actually. Dr. Thunder is better than Dr. Pepper, if you ask me. But I'd rather drink Mountain Dew than either of those, because I'm not really a dark drinker. <laughs> that hey, sounds bad. how you doing? You must be the new kid. I'm Pete. Pete Kowalski. Jimmy Hopkins, and don't ask how I'm doing. I've been here five minutes, and already people want me dead. Even my parents didn't hate me this quickly. Well, welcome to Bullworth. It's a dump. Great. I've been expelled from anywhere halfway decent. Yeah, I've been expelled from anywhere halfway decent, because I'm really bad. Give up the tough guy act, pal. Hey, man, what's your problem? Well, ADD primarily, but also life. My parents, this school, Western civilization, but really, honestly, enough about me. Oh, I see you've met the dorm's mascot. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Femboy, the his, his girliest boy in school. Petey, haven't you got some imaginary friends to go annoy? Why don't you leave me alone, Gary? <laughs> Look at you. Leave me alone, Gary. I'm really self-important now that I finally hit puberty. What's your problem? I'm just being nice to the new kid as he passes through Bullworth on his inevitable journey to prison. Look, I gotta unpack. Would you guys mind getting out of here? <laughs> oh, now look what you've done, Pete. Jimmy can't stand you already. What are we unpacking exactly? He didn't have a bag. Okay, whatever. Um, let's go ahead and save in case the game crashes. Oh, well, that was quick. Okay, um, sorry, impulse. Um, Petey's not really that girly. I don't get why Gary calls him femboy. Like, he, he looks pretty boyish to me. Oh, it's right here. Okay, good. This is your school. Oh, this is my jam. Let me show you around this That's Russell's luck. You know, the big ape who almost put you in the hospital. I don't know if it's a bad thing that I have like the harmony of the songs like memorized in my head and I always hum them. Give this dipshit our money. But those nuggies don't feel good. Hopefully it won't be too loud. Yeah, let's break into this numb skull's locker see what he has for us. Well done. I think it's always the hat, I'm not sure. You do know you're not supposed to be doing that. You know how to see me. Um, I actually have a funny story about that prefect there in particular. Me and my brothers and my cousin would always call that guy Principal Franklin because he looked like him. You know, from my Carly. I don't know, it was just a little funny joke we thought. 
thought of because he looks so similar. Oh man, there's that weird chick Eunice. Let's have some fun with her. Eunice, how's it been? Again, her crest is backwards. That's weird. Okay, let me turn this down. My goodness. I can't even hear myself talk. Okay. Should be good now. Yeah, I'm a little more sane now. I can hear myself. Skippity, skippity, skip, scop. <laughs> Alright. How dare you take her chocolate! Ah, get fucked in the face, motherfucker. Um, he, he still has it. Can, can I have it? I, I know I have it. I'm just messing around. That happens sometimes. Oh look, we can skip together. We're skipping buddies. <laughs> um, what do you want? Get away from me, please. I'm trying to give this girl her chocolate back. Never steal so much chocolate, it's rude. No, I'd rather not. Uh, shield your eyes, everyone. Okay, it's over. You know, I'm actually surprised that Gary doesn't bring that up and rub it in your face at all in the story later. Alright, feeding time at the zoo. Feeding time at the zoo. Okay, here's the deal. Over there we got the nerds. Of course, they're complete social outcasts. They look pretty harmless. They're actually sneaky bastards. Their turf is the library. Ooh, and those there's the Pinky. Preps, they're all money and condescending. As a kid, I had a little bit of a crush on her. And completely brainless. Very observant, Jimmy boy. Now over there are the greasers. They think they're tough. Or at least try to look tough. Wouldn't advise messing with them, at least not yet. They hang by the auto shop. And last but not least, the jocks. These guys rule the school. Definitely avoid them. Whatever, I'm not afraid of some dumb roid monkeys. You'll learn. See, a lot of them have their crest backwards. It's odd. You're here to learn, not to goof off. Get to class. Aye, aye, Captain. Yeah, so like I said, we're gonna do all the classes and whatnot, and we're gonna be a good student. Or, should I play it more realistically, like how Jimmy would actually, you know, pass the classes in real life? Because I feel like he would fail some. He doesn't seem like a very bright kid in all the departments. Okay, let's do it. First up is chemistry, I believe. Yep. Alright. This one's easy peasy. Take care to follow my instructions precisely, as we will be working with volatile chemicals today. Volatile. Whatever that means. Alright, let's do it. Very good. We're just mixing up Very potions. Good. Anyone can do this. Good job. Keep paying attention. Easy. We have a future ahead of you, young man. That is fun, don't get me wrong. I just wish it was a little bit faster, like Guitar Hero, in a way. But good, we got firecrackers now. That's what we needed. Oh, shit. I should punch you, but I'm not going to. I don't hit ladies. Unless I have to. <laughs> like so. Oh, well, uh, I just look dumb now. <laughs> Alright. The setup. You seem to be making yourself quite comfortable here, my boy. I'm just trying to fit in. By fighting? By making a nuisance of yourself? That is not the Bullworth way, boy. Yeah, you could have fooled me. What? I said you could have fooled me. This place is full of bullies and maniacs. Nonsense. That's just school spirit. Hijinks. Why, in my day, we felt nothing of castrating the new boys. I want you to stop this Cut nonsense. Cut their balls out? I want you to behave yourself. You might learn something. Fine. Can I go now, sir? On your way. I've actually got a story about that. Hey, I saw you sucking up to Crabble Snitch. What? Shut up. Screw you, new kid. 
This is what we do to teachers' pets around here. You better not slow! <laughs> come here, you little... Yeah, come and get me. Um, ironically, I have a story about castration, and it's very terrible. It's not very long, it's just a, a bad memory I don't want to remember. My neighbors used to have bulls, ironically enough. Get out the fucking way, Algy. And one day, I witnessed them castrating one of the bulls, and I felt so bad for him. He was making such terrible noises, and I, I can only imagine how he felt. Yeah, not the breath out of him. Wait, why am I wasting my energy on you? Here, get in the trash. Get in the trash where you belong. But um, yeah, moral of the story is bulls getting their nuts cut out is painful to think. Don't ever watch it. Yeah, second time beating this guy up today. Goody good. Let's hit him with the trash can and see what they do. Wait, alright. Come on, buddy. I love that. Is the music a tad bit loud? I feel like it is. Let's turn that to three. <laughs> Alright, he's down. Shit. Ah. Stop hitting people. <laughs> this is so funny looking, just the way they flop onto the ground. And... Penalty shot. Bounced off his freaking head, oh my god. Uh, let's do another break. Get down from there, peasant. This is my kingdom now. Alright, wonderful, we got the slingshot. So yeah, we can hit people with our projectiles now. Oh shit, that's Russell. No, I didn't mean it, Russell, I'm sorry. Leave me alone. Ah! I'm just trying to play soccer, Russell. I didn't mean it. Okay, he's tired. This, this dude really wants some more? I beat you up twice today. Okay, we got another class, and then we'll go do another mission. English one's fairly easy, from what I remember. Uh, hello, class. The curriculum demands that you do these vocabulary uh, assignments. Why don't you finish them here in class? That way you'll have more free time. God, why is he breathing so hard? Well, I mean, I was running, but anyway. Okay, um, I think this is the one where it spells mellow, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see. Yep, yep, okay. I'm gonna do that one first things first. Mellow. Show. Mm, can we do melon? No, there's no in. Shit. Leo. Leo. Try again, James. Omen? Wait, no. I don't think that's in the dictionary. Oh. Well done. Okay. Owl. Me too. Um. Owl. I'm afraid that's no? not English. Hmm. Well. That's right. Okay. Elm. Okay. Yeah, Elm. Nightmare on Elm Street. Hmm. I feel stupid. <laughs> I don't know. Let's scramble them up and see. Ollie. That has to be some sort of slang, yes? Mel. Try again, James. I'm just gonna type shit and see if it's correct. What is Mew? I, I don't know. Um L E M Try again, James. L E W Try again, James. L O L. <laughs> uh, it's it doesn't work. Okay. Mm. Mo. Try again, James. Mo. Try again, what? James. Um. Mel. Try again, James. Am I stupid or something? Like, is there something here I'm missing? Lou. Try again, James. No, what the fuck? Elmo. 
Try again, James. Elmo is a word, you motherfucker. God damn it. Ah, uncultured swines, I swear. Hmm, we're running out of time. I don't want to lose. Um, okay, three letter word. That shouldn't be that hard. Low. Try again, James. What? Wait. L O W low. Okay, that's a, that one works. Mao. Good one. What does Mao mean? I just I I thought I didn't think it would work, but I guess it is a word. What is Mao? I'm so confused. Well, we passed anyway, just barely. What other words are there? M mule. Good one. What is a mule? What? I just guessed that. Like, how? Lul. Try again, James. Lul. Try again, James. I don't know. We passed anyway. That's good enough. Ah, you have the makings of a poet laureate, James. Inside Russell's thick skin, beat heart of warrior poet. <laughs> Oh, he's getting me back for hitting him with the slingshot. I see, Russell. Yeah, I didn't mean it, buddy. I was just target practicing. And you, you happened to be there. It's easy when you know how. And done. Oh, what's up, Principal Franklin? Alright, now let's go do the missions. I'm not gonna skip the classes, or I'm not, I'm not gonna try to, at least, unless it's really important. Oh, it's empty now. Well, it's, it's, uh, the fence is gone. But what, what triggers that? Why does that happen? I, I don't get it. Bisbee. Meow. Look at it go. So majestic. Alright. Slingshot. So that's a good idea, right? Yeah, okay. Alright, sure. I'll do it. <laughs> hey, man, what's going on? Not much. I was just telling Petey here about my idea to take over the school. I mean... My plan for us to take over the school. What plan? Don't worry, Jimmy. It's just a little something I came up with. It's sink or swim, my friend. And if you're good at swimming, you gotta let the losers drown. Why don't you guys leave the thinking up to me? What? What? What, what the? Can't you say anything else? <laughs> you know what, Petey, you were right. Jimmy is pretty dumb. What'd you say about me? Whoa, nothing. No, no, no. All I said was that you had to be pretty dumb to get expelled from so many schools. That's all. <laughs> Relax, James. All he said was that you must be dumb. Or maybe you're all messed up because you came from a broken home. What'd you say about me, dwarf? Come on, dude. Chill. No, 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 no. Gary's taking everything out of context, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't lie, Petey. Don't you lie. Because you know what happens to liars? No, no, I'm not lying. We kick them in the balls! <laughs> Poor Petey. Come on, Jimmy, let's go see how good you are with this new slingshot I heard you had. Don't worry, friend. Nothing escapes my notice. I hear everything. You and me, we can do things. Man, I feel bad for Petey there. Why do you have to do that? I, I, I really don't like Gary, but he does a really good job of making you hate him. I'll, I'll give him that. Easy peasy. Okay. Easy peasy. Let's go do whatever else he's wanting us to do. Yeah, yeah I, I know. I know Gary. I've been here before, but not legitly. Okay, here we go. Did I mention already that I have mods installed? It's nothing game changing, like I said. It's just a few textures and whatnot. And a few clothing items, I think. Fuck, hit him. God dang it. Hit the fucker. Okay. Time to hit Burton. Hey, I was doing that. Let me hit him. 
Oh, he disappeared. Okay, I'll remember for next time. That was easy. Let's get out of here. Skedaddle. Let's see what what's next. Help algae and a little health. Hmm. I think I'll do a little health first. Then we'll try to help algae. Alright, a little help. Go on, Petey. Go cry to the teacher. Tell them I was nasty to you. Shut up, Gary. You're such a jerk, man. Oh, am I, Petey? Oh, you're so cutting. I'm really upset. Actually, I think I'm gonna go cry. That'd be just like you. Cry, little girl. Oh, God, he's such a dick. <laughs> Here comes Jimmy. Just knock it off, Gary. You're out of line. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize I was hanging out in the girls' dorm. Silly me. Shut up, man. You're boring. Boring? <laughs> I'm boring. Tell him how it is, Jimmy. You're none too interesting yourself, friend. <laughs> Look, I'm sorry, both of you. I apologize, okay? I just get a little overexcited. Forgive me. Forget it. It's cool. Anyway, I've got a good idea for some fun. Let's go out and torment someone really helpless and unfortunate. That homeless guy. Why? Uh, uh, come on. You coming, little Petey? Come on, I'm sorry. Jimmy's face. I'll give you a kiss if that's what you want. Shut up. Then come on. I can't tell if Jimmy is up for Gary's shenanigans or if he just really doesn't want to. This is gonna be fun. I'm going to assume that he's just going with it. It is. Alright, where is he? Where is this dirty old perv? You know, you're not very nice, Gary. And you're a loser, Petey. One of life's unfortunates. Get out of here, you little scum! <laughs> where did he come from? So I guess the rumors are true, Jimmy. Your dad does live on campus. Oh, you jerk! Ow! Let's leave this guy to his welfare payments. Come on, let's get out of here. Just get out of here, kid. Why should I? Because otherwise I'll kill you. What's your problem? <laughs> That's a long Nice spoken story. man. You got any liquor? No, I'm 15. Well, what about drugs? No. I don't like him then anymore. Why shouldn't I kill you? All right then, tough guy. Kill me. <laughs> you know what, nice. kid? I like your style. You got guts. When I was on that ridge in Korea, watching my buddies get killed by friendly fire, I could have used somebody like you. Yeah? Thanks. But I bet you can't fight. You do me a favor, and I'll show you some real moves. Classified moves. Real special army stuff. Cool. Just get me a part for my radio and I'll show you what the army taught me. What, like how to get shot by your own side? Exactly. All right, you gotta find Mr. Hobo Man's transistor. I gotta be easy saying that word because it sounds like... <laughs> Never mind. It just sounds bad. Cheesy joke. Anyway, um, I don't know how Jimmy knows where this thing is. Like, he just automatically goes to the roof of this place and he's like, Hey, my, my uh, radio part oh, senses cool. were tangling. That's just what I'm gonna refer it to. Yeah, work with your hands. I broke your crap card window, now you're mad. I'm sorry. Oh shit. I'll deal with you guys later. I gotta learn a fighting move real quick. Maybe I can use it on them. Now, what you got for me? Uppercut? Easy. I, I did that earlier, didn't I? Thought so. Don't forget to bring me a transistor when you come back. Aye, aye, Captain. Will do. 
How long should we play this guy? Should we just do a few missions and then call it quits, or should we do the entire chapter? I don't know. It just depends whenever I feel sleepy, I guess. Don't go away, don't go away, don't go away. I'm right here, I'm right here. Oh, no, I was so close. Damn it. Okay. Well, we'll do that one first thing in the morning. Let's go ahead and go sleep, and we'll do that. It really makes me uncomfortable how he sleeps with his door open. I couldn't do that. Alright, alright. You guys might think this is pointless, but I just, I want, I don't want to break up the immersion. It makes sense that he would do that. I'm picky with little stuff like this. Get our stuff fully... Fully ammoed, okay. Um, let's see... Yeah, we'll do save algae. Oh, Mr. Luntz. There he is. I, I want to get his broom. I gotta do it every time I see him. Get up. Thank you, Mr. Luntz. You're a good man. Yeah. How dare you go in the library? <laughs> so, you're the new kid, huh? Everyone is talking about you. Oh, are they? And what are they saying? Uh, nothing. Just that you're friends with that sociopath Gary. Socio what? Sociopath. It means... Never mind. Forget I said anything. I need you to help me. Wait, you need me to help you? I've got some library books that need to be returned, but I'm too scared to go to my locker. Do I look like a librarian? No, listen. I need your help. Pretend we're friends. Walk with me. I'll pay. <laughs> I'll pay you two bucks. Tip your two pants bucks. Up, man. Are you crazy? Make it five. No. Two bucks? Great. Five bucks. Let's go, buddy. Jimmy knows how to get his way. That's a smart kid. Oh, I still got the broom. Good. I'm going to use it against them. Bring it on! I knew it. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Meant to hit this guy. Yeah. And go down. Well, he, he would have made fun of him eventually too, so uh, I took him out before it could happen. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck off. Yeah. Ooh. It's always the best finisher, in my opinion. I love doing that to them. Alright, come on, Algae. Could be in a slow boat. We'll get you to the Tinkle Machine. Oh shit, the class is on right now. Uh, come on, Algae, we gotta hurry up. I gotta go to class. Algae? Oh, oh, there he is. Okay. <laughs> Stop for me. I'm going in. The heck? What were they doing in there? Oh god. Ah, that was weird. I always forget that that happens. It's always a little shocker every time. You know, I got something special for you. Just, just watch. Let me bleed the lizard real quick. Alright, now here you go. Oh, what? No, 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 no. Don't you dunk me. Eh. Alright, get up. Taste it! Taste it! Taste my pee pee! <laughs> What's on your shoes, man? What are you even doing in there, algae? Okay, let me quit being a creep. I thought that said Jimmy. Who's Jenny? Jenny. There's only one Jenny I know, and that's another character I had a crush on as a kid. As a kid, but I can't talk. XJ9, Jenny. She's a gentle, sweet robot. Tell my mom that not 
everyone at Bullworth is mean. He actually pulled it out of his pocket too. It didn't, he didn't pull it out of his ass. He, it came out of his pocket. All sorted. All right, let's go to class. But we're late. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Arts. I'm Miss Phillips, and it is my pleasure to induct you into the world of arts. Yes, let's do it. You know what's ironic about this class? I'm I'm real I'm pretty decent at art in real life, but this this one is probably the hardest minigame to me. I don't know. It's just a thing. All right, can we get this in one go? Oh, that's a good one. Oh, oh, nice. Come on. Oh, no. ah, that was smooth. Didn't get hit. Wonderful. That was easy. Certainly captured my character. Very good. Okay, I'm still in shot. Awesome wow. sauce. Did you get a nose Maybe job or something? <laughs> I really love bunnies. They're so nice. They are nice. Well, except one or or two. A, a lot of rabbits aren't nice, actually. Just for you. Oh, Jimmy, that's so nice of you. Come on, give me a kiss. Where the heck did you get those flowers? <laughs> Do you think anyone saw? Mm, probably. No problem. Another job well done. Mm, nah, I don't think anyone saw. We're good. Don't worry, Angie. I know a lot of the characters' names already. If you guys are wondering, like, let's see. Um, well, I I don't know your name. Are you fatty? I think you're fatty. Um, oh, there's Angie again. This this is the girl I always ship with Jimmy. Like, they seem like a good couple. I don't think Jimmy would actually get a, a tall girl like that. Um, we're just gonna wait on the next class, I guess. I don't think we should go to the other mission just yet. We start a food fight. Mm, him. Oh, I hit him in the balls. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Throw it at that muscle head. Give it to me. Give me the fucking apple. <laughs> I look like it fucking hurt. Like an apple to the balls? Who threw that? Oh, you fucking. Yeah. Oh shit. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. No, 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 no. I gotta go. I gotta go. They have their spidey senses when you fucking hit a girl. I swear to god. They do it every time. God dang it, it's an outside class? Okay. Why are you running after me? I'm literally going to class. Like, you're a little dramatic, buddy. Let's grab yeah, this while we're at it. I do want to try to 100% the game in this playthrough as well. Like, I want to do everything legit the first time around. Alright, Wimps, it's time for some wrestling instruction. This rule will require physical contact between you and your opponent. Don't any of you enjoy it? Yeah, sure. Everyone loves being sweaty and touching each other. Oh man, did you guys see Pinky in her cheerleading dress? Let's go over here and see. Oh, look at her. My tender soul. She's so cute over there in her dress. Oh, headbutt. I'm not even paying attention. Pinky's over here got me distracted. A, a 3D game character is about to make me act up. Hmm. Get fucked. Get out of here. Yeah, you see this, Pinky? You like this? Yeah. What did she say? Did she say poor world girls have lovely chests? So that's weird, mate. That was easy. Hopkins, I was wrong about you. Maybe you really Look at her over there cheering for me. Strong girl. I was about to say, like, finally, give me my reward. Hopkins comes through. Heck yeah. All right, what's next? Um, defend Bucky and that bitch. Hmm. Defend Bucky or that bitch? I think we should do Defend Bucky. I want the skateboard already. Oh yeah, I forgot also that I have a mod where Jimmy has a backpack now. And I want to go get it real quick. Oh 
shit. Ben. Yeah, I want to go buy that backpack real quick because it's it looks pretty cool on him. That's one of the mods that I mentioned earlier. Um, this way. Hey, Mr. Lunch, give me a backpack, will ya? Oh shit. Oh, forget. I forgot I have the no clip mod installed still. Okay, let's not press down. There we are. See, it's the. I think that's Michael's backpack from. Bleh. I believe that's Michael's backpack from GTA 5, but somebody added it to Bully and it it's really well, honestly. I love the way it looks. Okay, he's a little creepy. We're gonna get away from him now. But yeah, we got a backpack. That's pretty cool, right? Let's go do Defend Bucky. That's this way. What do you want? Fuck off. God, people always following me and shit. I mean, I know Jimmy's pretty and all, but God. <laughs> that's, that's just a joke, by the way. He looks like a 40-year-old man. What the fuck? Oh. I thought the game crashed. Yeah, yeah, I know. Let me do it. Okay, get me do it so I can go get the skateboard. Come on. So I'm gonna need your help with this. Take Peter's package to Beatrice. Yeah, okay. Thanks. I mean, I think he can do that on his own. All right, buddy, we'll do that for you, and we gotta do this mission. La 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 We won't have to do much skipping after we get the skateboard here in a moment. Much obliged. And it's his beta skateboard, by the way. That's another one of the mods. I'm done. Like, I'm not gonna install mods that are like textures or anything that's gonna affect the whole game. I just wanted some simple stuff. Like, I wanted Jimmy to have a backpack and... I, I like the old skateboard to look better and everything. You know, it's just little mods. Nothing really game breaking. Oh, Defend Bucky. Here we go. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that out. Stop, Gary. <clears throat> Trying to watch this. Ah, swim team. Intellectual stuff. So tell me, Petey, do you Come like on. watching the girls in their swimming costumes? Ah, Does that fuel okay. your filthy little fantasy? That's a doorknob here. Hit me. Oh, Marion, show me your breaststroke again. Or. Wait, do you like the boys on the team? Yeah, right, Gary. Which is it, Petey? What I see the you guys fuck? are getting along as usual. I'm just toughening ow, him up. Ow. Turning him into oh. a man or a woman or something. I believe I installed something wrong. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Petey. Ah, peace stain. Okay. Good to see you. Listen, Jimmy, I need a favor. Bucky went to the auto shop to get some parts for his science projects. He hasn't come back yet. I think he might be in trouble. Please. Why don't you go yourself? <laughs> what the fuck? I've got homework. <laughs> okay, I'm frightened. And I've got a weak bladder. Well, I think the bullies might have gotten him. Please, I'll pay. I say do it. It's a good chance to show Russell who's in charge around here. <laughs> it's just on his now head. Now run along, Ow. peace stain, before you mark the carpet. Yes. We've got to take care of Russell and his boys. Then, after that, take care of all the other cliques. Soon, this school will be ours. I don't want the school. Yeah, well, I do, pal, and I intend to get it. Now go help that door. And what are you gonna do? I've got planning to do. I can't really take the cutscene as serious. Suck it off. <laughs> Sorry. <Boop>. Stop. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, well, clearly I installed something wrong. That's one of the mods as well, a duffel bag, so... I'm just gonna go and remove it from Jimmy's back, because... If it's gonna be doing that, then we don't need it. Oh shit. Okay. What? Okay. God. These these mods are distracting me sometimes. I didn't even mean to have that one left in. It's just I forgot. Oh shit, Bucky's getting beat up. Hey, gimme that. Not him! Sorry. Gimme your bat. Gimme your bat. I need this. There's a nerd in help. There's a nerd in need. I need this. Alright, let's go. Fuck off, I need it. Oh shit, he's in the red. No, we're coming, Bucky. We're gonna save you. 
Don't you die on us, Bucky. Don't you do it. Oh, he's dying. Fucking go, Jimmy. Get out of my gosh darn way. Fuck you. Ah. Bat on bat combat. No, I hit him. God. Okay. I should have had the backpack off to begin with. Fuck. We gotta go do it again. Shit. Yeah, like, like I said, that's one of the mods as well. It's a duffel bag, and I was gonna wear that one in the mission where he does the panty raid, because I think that one would be pretty cool. It would make sense. And there's also one where he has a bandit mask. That one does work, though. I checked it out. And it did work correctly, as far as I know. We're coming, Bucky. God, you're already in the yellow. He's weak. Stop beating him. Oh, God, stop hitting him. Okay, come here. You guys come here. Come here. Alright. Oh, shit. Yeah. Fuck you. This is for beating Bucky. Get fucked. Alright, who's next? What the f- Hey, how he runs. So weird. Oh, no, you don't. Come back here. No. No! Fuck off. Run, Bucky. Do whatever you gotta do. I'm gonna help you, but you gotta stay clear of them. Okay. Anyone else? Oh, right here. here. Wait, where is it? Bucky? Oh, he hasn't. It hasn't loaded yet, of course. Yeah. Right, you need a soda, Bucky. You're low on health. Critical on health. Get his bat? What? I didn't know you could do that. Yeah. Love doing that finisher. It's still not there. Okay, whatever. This. Nice to know there's a violent, crazy old man on campus. Thanks to me. There it is. Look at it, it's so cool. Why would they give us the other one? It's so boring. Like, this one looks much better. It's a little bit lower on the polygons, but it's still fucking cool. Like, look at this. Just awesome. I love that. No, get out of my face, you're annoying. I don't like you. Alright. Get our potions up and going. And we'll get to class. See, that bitch. Hmm. I think I should do the classes before that bitch, because that'll probably take a little while. I'm trying to think of everything logically, like how they would actually do it and whatnot. I don't know. I'm, I'm very picky when it comes to little stuff like this. Let's go have some breakfast, shall we? Edna, what we cooking today? What do you want? I hear you're mechanically apt, but I'm not sure I believe it. Fine. Yeah, I'm game. Wrong. Very much a fine. Why would Mr. Hattrick call me? All right, let's pick some lockers for this little chick. Um, God, all these are blue. I need more growth hormone. That guy loves his growth hormone, doesn't he? Go, Jimmy, go, Jimmy, go, Jimmy. Alright. Blue hoodie, nice. Let's see. Ooh, two of them, right here, perfect. When I was little, I thought this was the most coolest feature in any video game ever. A banana? Get that shit out of here. Polo shirt. That's that's really good. Algae, I don't have time for you right now. I just helped you not long ago. Biology. Hello, children. Welcome to the world of biology. I hope you all have strong stomachs. 
I love him. He's so funny. Like, just how creepy he is. I think I can do his voice really good, too. Not the boy, boy. The plant boy. Uh, I'm, I'm spoiling it a little bit. But yeah, I, I can do his voice pretty good, in my opinion. Um, I'm doing this with a controller, so... Take your time, boy. Might be a little difficult. Art. Patience, Hopkins. Yeah. Can't rush science. Well, I'm gonna rush it today because I'm in a little bit of a hurry. Gotta get out here and throw a stink bomb at that bitch. Alright, let's cut out your little heart, buddy. I'm sorry. It's not my decision. Kind of looks like an acorn a little bit. A moist, blood pumping acorn. Smells great. I bet Gary would love this. Like, he seems like the type to be like, it looks so cool. I want to do more. You know, like, I just imagine Gary doing that. Fucking shit. Okay. Oh, nasty. Jimmy seems thoroughly disgusted, which I'm a little shocked about. He seems like he would have seen this stuff before. What's the matter? Don't you like cutting things God, it's so complicated with the controller. I'm not gonna cheat with the mouse. I, I wanna finish it. Remember, slow and steady wins the race. I know, I know. A good start, okay. Hopkins. Let's see if you can keep it up, shall So we? far, so good. We're being a good student. Did you see that? Muscle shirt. Nice work, Jimmy. Nice. Woohoo. Oh, that was sick. Okay, let's just skate around school until... I didn't do anything. <laughs> Good, nice. I didn't, need, I didn't even see that, and I'm glad he slipped on it. Jimmy loves his apples, my goodness. Eating them all in one bite. Nerds. <laughs> I rarely provoke the nerds, so I don't really hear their theme song that much. You know, let's let's have some old-fashioned fun. Let's get this, and let's go a-spraying. Run, everyone! Run! Ah, get out of my way. I gotta go put out the fire. Where's the fire? Where is it? Oh, shit. Ah, out of my way. I gotta find it. Out of the way, everyone! There's a fire! Don't you hear the bells? That means fire! Run! Oh, it's in the music class, of course! <laughs> I don't know. Okay, music. That's Hello, L2 and R2. Hello, and girls! I'm Ms. Peters, and I'm going to be your music teacher this year! How wonderful! Okay. Um, I'm usually pretty good at this one, but sometimes I suck if I'm sleepy. I'm gonna try to get it all perfect. I'm not sure if we can do that or not, but I feel like we can. <laughs> that 99%, that bothers me. That was actually on time. Great job. Well, we passed anyway. That's all that's important. You paying attention? Musical key shirt. We're getting all the clothes early, aren't we? That's good. Good day. Good day, matey. All right, let's go do that bitch. Um, let's quickly save in case it crashes, because Willie has a tendency of doing that. Save it, you do. Yes, we all remember you, Sheldon. How could we forget? I'm not supposed to be in here, but oh well. Oh shit. That bitch. Give it back. Or what? Or well, just give it back. Are you threatening uh, me, Metal Mouse? No, I just just give it back. You can't just steal things from me. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, my pig ugly friend, that is exactly what I can do. In fact, I can do anything <laughs> I like in this place. Anything at all. Ciao, Spotty. Give it back. 
And you should stay out of the girls' dorm, you little perv. Ugh, I see you undressing me with your eyes, sicko. You wish. Please, will you help me? Do I have to? <laughs> yes, it's vital. She's stolen my lab notes. Without them, I'm gonna fail chemistry and I'll never get into med school. Now I won't find the cure for cancer. Basically, the future of the whole world rests on those notes. What's in it for me? Well, if you get them back, I'll... I'll kiss you. Oh, uh, that's okay. <laughs> oh, okay, but if you don't, I'll tell the whole school you're some kind of sad sicko who spies on girls getting changed in their dorm. Relax. One set of lab notes coming up. I mean, I'd, I'd rather kiss her than fucking Eunice. I mean, she Eunice tried to eat my face off. Anyway, oh, speaking of kissing, that, that, that's just a sign to stay away from her. Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. I wanted to eat it. Okay, um, what are we doing here? Uh, go to the gym. Right. I remember whenever I tried to play that mission as a kid, um, my grandma saw the word the bitch pop up on the screen and she made me turn it off because it had a cuss word. I was so sad. Like, I wanted to play the game so much and that just made me want to play it more. Oh shit. Oh, hi Pinky. Hi, how you doing? Look at her run. So majestic. She's the only one with a pink locker. Uh-oh. Where is she? Oh, there she is. <laughs> oh. Ah, sick. She just did an exorcist on us. Poor Mandy. Well, no, not poor Mandy. She's a bitch. She deserved it. Oh, wait. What if... Oh, wait, hang on. This is, there's a thing. If you put one of these in the toilet, they'll all splash water. What happens? <laughs> oh my god, I, I didn't know you could do that. That's hilarious. So she got stanked on and she got shit water put on her. Wonderful. That, that's a good, um, that's a good, uh, uh, what the fuck is the word? I can't think. That's a good revenge, if you ask me. There you go. Hey. That's all it takes nowadays, it's just a hey. I think we can call that a wrap. Sure can. Alright. Uh what's next? The candidate. I don't know if we're gonna be doing every mission, but at this rate it seems like we're going to, so I'm gonna try and keep this up before my phone dies there. Move, nerd! Oh. <laughs> How original. <laughs> Call me a nerd. What next? Four eyes? Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt All me! Alright, you oh. ass boy. What's this? <laughs> class... Press... Dance. Class president, dummy. It says class president. I don't know. That's no. you? I'm the most suitable candidate I know. <laughs> yeah, so's your mom. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> oh, man. Don't forget to wipe. <laughs> Did you hear his little scream campaign, of Ernest. agony? You'll vote for me, won't you? Yeah, not a chance. What if I pay you? Pay me? Now you're talking. I always knew I was a born leader. <laughs> yeah, but unless you buy everyone's vote, you're never gonna win. Because they are definitely gonna ruin your speech at the debate. Oh, oh. oh. unless I had a security manager. Oh, oh, please, please, I don't please, know. Security please, managers, they please. cost a lot of money. Oh, I have money. I can pay you. Good. I've always been a politician at heart. Hmm, wonder what that means. Alright, let's go get to his little speech he has going. I think this gives us the super slingshot. Yeah, it does. How long have we been recording? I'm not even sure. Alright, here we go. 
I'm really trying to be upbeat, but it's a little hard right now. Like, I, I feel a little sleepy, but I don't know. I'll be, I'll promise I will be in the next one. Where are they? Yeah. Somebody should add some gun sound effects to this mission. Let down by the establishment. Get out of here. I feel your pain, my children. I hit them. <laughs> he didn't care. Salvation is here, my friend. Yeah. By choosing me as your leader, we will usher in a new era of education. Abusive prefects? God. Yeah. No match for me and my slingshot. Gone. Physical education. Gone. Full work will be the model for a pure academic. I hit him. Okay, whatever. Money no longer wasted on silly musicals or crafts. My opponent would have to believe that sports are more meaningful for your future. Oh shit! <laughs> I've never seen them do that. Wow. I knocked him off the railing. God, they just keep coming, don't they? They don't learn. Oh, there he is. Get out of here. How did he lose health? I never hit him. Yeah, I, I don't remember. No one hit him that I know of. God, he's doing the thing I do Thank here. You, Good night. Yay. Good job. I just wish there was more to that mission. It's a little bit of a bummer, honestly. Okay. Uh, what do we got to do? Where's the clock? Our clock seems to have vanished. Halloween! Oh yes, okay. We're gonna complete chapter one in this episode. Yep, the skeletons are out. Look at them. Let's have a look at them. It looks like me. <laughs> I'm just hanging in the trees. Who did that? Oh heck yeah. Okay, we gotta kick all of these, I remember. I wanna get all the achievements in the game as well. Make sure I don't miss any. Okay. We started there. Let's go do Halloween. Ah, I just love this. It's wonderful. I put a costume in your closet. Oh shit. I forgot he's just laying there in the bed. What's up, dude? Why are you in my bed? Jimmy, don't be a brat. Put it on. You you wanna get out of my bed? Oh, <laughs> Gary, are you good with this? Your costume, Jimmy, put it on. I'm, I'm trying to shit on your head. Give me a second. <laughs> okay, let's quit messing around. I started to get the hey, mod of his beta costume, but I was just lying here controversial. Be more like you. Yeah, whatever. But I'm cursed. Yeah, really. <laughs> yeah, cursed by brains. Do you know what torture it is to be? Thinking all the time. No, of course you don't. Yeah, you're cursed. You're great. Whatever. What else is going on? Not much. Let me see. Uh, it's Halloween. 
All the prefects are at some party and the teachers are entertaining, I use that word loosely, the kids. No, I'd say the opportunities for fun are pretty much nil. What do you have in mind? Come on, you'll see. Jimmy's costume is pretty cool, but um, Let's go get Pete. as I was saying about Gary's costume, like, they, like, even if they do remove his armband, like, he still has the eagle on his hat. I mean, it's, I don't know, like, it's, it just seems pointless. Oh shit, I've got to kick the pumpkins. Hang on, sorry. Ooh. Okay, let's go kick the pumpkins. We gotta kick those. And we'll get a pumpkin head, I believe. Wonder why no one picked this up. Make sure we get all of these. Goody, goody, goody. Excuse me. And in here. Nope, we're good. Okay. Nope. I love the Halloween music. What do you? Oh. Okay, Heck yeah. Aw, oh, Pinky, look at her. She is such a princess. Oh. Mm, well, she, she doesn't seem to be in the liking of me at the moment. Um, let's, let's do it to this guy. Wait, no, I want to do it to a girl. I, I don't like her. Let's do it to her. There we go. Kick the bitch. Is no one gonna take the bait? No, 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 don't hit on her. Okay, whatever. Wait. Did she do it? I think she did it. I don't know. Okay, anyway, let's actually go along with it. Oh, gotta kick these. Kick the tombstones. Kick the resting place of the dead. Another one over here. Yeah. Oh, sorry, buddy. Any over here? Nope. Get a few of these for later. My original plan for playing this game was I was going to dress up actually as his Halloween costume. I thought it would be cool, but I was just, just too eager to play it, so I did it now. Missed opportunity a little bit, but it's fine. Oh shit. I think the rest of them are in the school. Um, well, we'll get those when we do the doggy poo. Get that while we're at it. Okay, let's do a few of these while we're at it. Yeah, sure. Can you be one of them? Come on. Take your own bait. None of them? Come on. Trip on them. Can I be the one? Oh, I guess not. I didn't hit you. Come on, walk in them. Right there we go. Wonderful. <laughs> Great. Right, let's kick these. Is there any over here? I gotta destroy pumpkins. You want me to destroy your head too? You don't play with me. Okay. I don't think there's any decorations here. The greasers don't seem to like Halloween too much. Except that guy. Pumpkinator guy. Go check the Harrington house. Harrington, I should say. Wow, why is everyone talking about my shoes? They're just boots. Leave me alone. Okay, there's some in here. Let's go ahead and kick them before the dog is in here. Oh, two and one, good. Okay, we got two more tombstones to go. Good. We're getting there. 
Oh, there's Pinky. Oh shit. He he tripped looking at her. What's up? Yeah, I'll do that. Here you go. You too, have some. Piggy man. There you go. Here's another pumpkin. Uh, I'm guessing he made that. What you got, alien? Oh, hell yeah. This, this one's my favorite. I love doing this. Um, sweet. Alright, here you guys go. Take a look at that. Edna mask. Oh yeah, we got it. Okay, good. What are you doing? Come here. Ah. Tricked him. He ran right into it. Oh shit, it affected me too. Well, I guess I didn't trick him after all. Yeah, we gotta do one more. I threw eggs, uh, um, itching powder on you, but okay. Squeeze the weasel. Squeezel. Alright, big prank. Let's go do it. Here we go, the big okay, prank. Here's the deal. We're gonna feed Chad's dog some of this rancid meat. Wait for him to take a dump, and then... What the hell? I'm out of here. Whatever, Pete. Okay, let's do this, Jim. I'll explain the rest later. Get over here, you little mutt. Come here, buddy. We gotta feed you some meaties. Alright, get out of here. We're not doing anything with him. He's our dog now. Yeah. Yeah. Fucked. Alright. Here we go. That's gross. This rocking back and forth. I've never seen a dog do that. Like, it always All makes right, me laugh. Let's go to the oh man, look at me. Got a bag of shit. <laughs> I think you could throw it at people. Can't? Don't I remember that? <laughs> uh, it's it's nothing, man. It's just chocolate in here. I swear. I put Nutella in a bag. That's just how I do it. Leave me alone. Hey, man, want some Nutella? Oh, it hit him in the balls. And it stuck to him. Pick it up. Yeah. God, everyone hates me now. It's just Nutella, guys. Don't, don't worry. Chill out. Okay. Here we go. Trespassing. What are, you, what are you guys doing in here? You guys need to shut up. We're inside the school at night. It's very scary at night. This was a fear I had as well as a child. And throughout my teens a little bit as well. Oh shit, what the fuck? I'm trying to tell a story, you motherfucker. Get the fuck on. Okay, let's get away from them. I'm gonna go into the girls' bathroom. But the the school at nighttime always scared me, because I was afraid there would be some monster or something, or... Well, really, I was afraid of the prefects, because they had their flashlights, and it just looked so menacing. I hated it. Okay. Just wanted to tell that little story there, see if anyone else related. Get rid of the rest of these. I don't think we're gonna get rid of all of them on Halloween night. I think you have to do the, the big mission at the end of this chapter to get the rest of them. Yeah, I think that's how you do it. Okay. Go ahead and do this. Very in the Cafeteria. Yeah, there is. Glad I looked. Edna doesn't even have to dress up for Halloween. She's already fucking scary. More here. No, nope, we're good. Watch it. All right, let's go give them our bag of Nutella. Ooh, camera's hopping with me. That's new. Any down here I'm missing? Nope, we're good. Okay. Nutella time! Let's let him get this chocolate on his feet. Don't worry, it'll be funny. 
I, I, I believe you. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> ah, yes, that's awesome. Oh, well, it's not awesome, it's disgusting, but it's, it's funny. Oh shit. I'm sorry. It wasn't my idea. It, w it was Sheldon's. Oh, he's pissed. Look at him. Just watching me skate away. He, he'll remember. He'll, he'll get a vengeance on me. Just watch. Look how the camera's doing that. That's not normal. That's really cool. You know, like, doing a lot of jump too. I've never seen it do that. Or perhaps I'm misremembering. I don't know. Anyway, that was pretty fun. Let's get some sleep in our costume. Wake up and have a skeleton print on our pillow. Who took off my costume in my sleep? I bet it was Gary's doings. He put the costume in my drawer and then he took it away. Oh yeah, I've got the uniform on. What's happening? Who did that? Oh wait, we gotta do it. I remember. Jimmy had this earlier. Fire! Run! Everyone run! There's a fire! Run! Get out the way! Get out of the building! There's a fire! Get out of the building, there's a fire, are you stupid? <laughs> okay, let's do a mission. Help Gary. Oh, this is the final one. This chapter. <laughs> there you are. Come on, I found something incredible. Hold on, relax, man. I can't keep getting in trouble. I can't get expelled again. Last mission, it's always guys. about me with you. Me, me, me. I'm thinking bigger picture, and you're worrying about getting into trouble? You know what? You really are something. What bigger picture? I'm, uh, we are gonna take over this school. We are not taking over anything right now. Time and tide wait for no man, my friend. But it seems they do wait for a wannabe tough guy who's nothing but a little girl. You're full of it. So you keep telling me, look, now come on, I promise you, after this, things are never going to be the same again. Oh, I'm so excited! I should have stopped taking those pills ages ago. Yeah, right. Whatever you say, Gary. Yeah, you need him. Yeah, you're more... Not more, I got him copying him. He's a... he's a psycho. See, the camera's doing that. That's... that's not normal. It's not supposed to do that. I like it, though. I'm not complaining. But it's just weird. It's not used to that. That's not a mod either. Where are we going? What is he doing? Oh yeah, we gotta fight these dicks, of course. Hey idiots! Jimmy's gonna kick your ass! Right, Jimmy? No, I'm gonna blow their ass up. Yeah. Oh shit. Sorry, Gary. My bad. Even though you kinda of deserve it. You. That was a smooth entrance. This is a little different, uh, Mr. Lunt's bed, of course. I'm gonna smash his TV so he'll be pissed at me. Oh, you don't say. Let's do it. You're really gonna like this, Jimmy. Oh, I am. Well, all right. What are you gonna do? You coming? You, you bringing me down here to do dirty things to me? Jimmy. It sounds so sexual how he's saying it, like, you're really gonna like what I'm gonna show you, Jimmy. I know you will. We can't get in there. How can we get the switch? I know how to get the switch, you dumbo. You're really gonna like this, Jimmy. <laughs> he keeps saying it. You're really gonna like this, Jimmy. No, here's another switch I oh shit. Whoa, laggy. Hmm. Looks like I'll pull this down again. Is he gonna say it again? I'm anticipating it. Almost there. Nah. It would've been funny if he did it again. Shit. I remember when I was a kid, I did this this mission in his underwear. It was funny. Huh. Alright, rest of the pumpkins. 
Yeah! Oh, and another transistor. Okay. What's in that room? Another loading room? That's weird. The school has a weird setup. Quick before it heats up again. I know, I know the drill. Fire! Run, everyone! I found the fire! Run! Wait. Oh yeah, this way. Oh wait, I gotta get to class! This is gonna make me late. Well, hopefully we can beat Russell before. Run, Gary, run! There's a fire! So, Jimmy boy, here we are! The, the hole. The place where this school separates the men from the boys. The wheat from the chaff and all that nonsense. Okay, so what's that got to do with standing up to people? Keeping them in line? This is where I stand up to you, my friend. What are you talking about? Yeah, let me beat your ass. I know you hate me, Jimmy boy. I know you said all that stuff about me behind my back. What are you talking about? Don't play innocent with me. You want to run this school? I want to run this school. Only one of us is going to make it. And it's going to be me! Egotistical much. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and morons, I give you Russell! Oh, man. Me, Russell! Gary, now I hate you. I know. Russell. Go beat that little jerk who said that nasty stuff to me about your mom and those barnyard uh, animals. What? Come here. Russell wants vengeance. Uh, I, I do like Russell, but his heart's just not in the right place at this point in the story. Okay, let's beat him up. Come on. Oh, shit. Yeah. Uh oh. Yeah. He's going full Harambe on me. Grab him? No, no chance. No chance I'm gonna grab him. Oh shit, oh shit. Come on, you're charging. Charge at me, Russell. Come on. Come on. Oh, here we go, here we go. Whoop. Oh, he got me. Ah. Yeah, no. Oh shit. I wanna beat him fair and square. I don't wanna use weapons on him. Punch, punch, punch. Oh shit. Punch, punch, punch. Punch, punch, punch. We're pretty equal right now. Shit. I won't be for long if he keeps doing that shit. No. Okay, punch. Punch, punch, punch. Punch, punch, punch. Punch, punch, punch. Punch, punch, punch. Come on, Russell. Yeah. Let me have this one. Oh. No, God. No. Batista bomb. Ah! <laughs> yeah. Oh shit. Oh, getting beat. I better not get hit again. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no. I'm gonna die. Ah. Oh, I, feel so good. I lost. I've never lost. Of course, on my playthrough, I would lose. Isn't that something? I didn't know that was a cutscene for if you lost. So, Jimmy Boy! Oh, good, a checkpoint. Wonderful. The hole. Okay, the yeah, place. yeah, yeah. Let's try it again. I'm so glad there's a checkpoint. Okay, come on. Do your thing. Man, I'm embarrassed now. I've gotta make up my um my loss here. I'm gonna beat all the other click members, no problem. I mean Russell's a big dude. You gotta you gotta think about that. Realistically, Jimmy would get his ass handed to him a little bit. Oh shit. So we're doing good so far right now. Just keep this going. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. No, no, no. Okay. Slam your head. Come on. Oh, no, no, no. Get away, you ape! <laughs> yeah, get fucked. Ah. Andre the giant motherfucker. Ah. Punch, punch, punch. 
punch, punch, punch. Yeah, that's more like it. Yeah. You happy now, jerk? They <laughs> just lay down. I to watch two morons beat the crap out of each other. Why'd you do it, Gary? I thought we were friends. <laughs> friends? You and me. I've taken dumps that had more brains than you, friend. No. I'm taking over this school, and you're just a liability. See you around, moron. Well done, Jimmy. Yeah, great. What a waste of time. You all right, Russell? Poor Russell. <sighs> yeah? Look, I never said anything about your mom or farmyard animals. You did it? No, but I want you to stop bullying weak kids. Why? Ah, because there are a bunch of kids around this place who need a beating, and you're picking on the few who don't. So I want you to leave me and him alone. Oh, okay. Sorry. Bad Russell. <laughs> uh, he's he's so innocent with, with his child mind. I could be forgiven for thinking my troubles at Bull Chapter Bull, two. But this place is a rotten onion. Peel off one stinking layer, and there's another even smellier one beneath. Good stuff. Okay, I think there's a cutscene. Well, scene. Jimmy, yeah. word on the street is you're something of a pugilist. No, sir, I never pugilized in my life. Really? And that you've been saying some entertaining things about me and some barnyard animals? <laughs> yeah. No, I never said that. Well, I listen to things, Hopkins. You try and stay out of trouble. Now go see the cook down in the kitchen. Helping her might teach you some humility. Okay, sir. Hey, new kid. You're that guy that beat up Russell. So? What's it to you? Hey, listen, we like to box the noble art and all that. Why don't you come down by our gym in old Bullworth Vale? We should definitely hang out. Yeah, I've heard a lot of things about you. Yeah, whatever. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wonderful. Okay. Let's go save real quick and I'll end off the episode here. Save, save, save. Okay. Alrighty guys, well that about does it for this episode. I really enjoyed this. This was my first video on my channel and I really look forward to doing many more of these very soon. So look forward in a few days or whenever for the next episode of this because I'm going to keep playing through it of course. Um, if you guys have any suggestions for games that you guys would like to see me play then you can say those in the comments below and I might check those out as well. Um, I primarily play horror games, that's what I'm going to try to do, but I just really love Bully so much and I wanted to play it once on my channel at least. So yeah, comment down below the games that you guys would like to see me play. Hope you all enjoyed the video and I'll see you all in the next one. Ace out. Feels good to do that again.